Okay, in this video we're looking at what is a differential equation. Um, differential equation is simply just an equation that contains derivatives. Um, so don't get scared away by these things. It's uh, Those derivatives can be ordinary or partial, but we'll get to that later. Um, but basically it's just an equation with derivatives in it. Not too bad, right? So first of all, we'll compare it with a regular equation, which is something you're probably used to by now. Something simple like 3x plus 4 is equal to 7. Right Now to solve a regular equation, we just want to solve for the variable. So the solution to this equation is x is equal to 1. Right, That's the solution to a regular equation. Um, now with a differential equation, I said there's derivatives in the equation. So an example would be x times y prime minus y is equal to x squared. Okay, so this might be the first differential equation you've ever seen. If so, awesome, you came to the right place. Um, notice there is some, there is y prime, there's this derivative appearing in our equation. So the solution to a differential equation is actually just another equation. It's not, we're not just solving for a variable. And we want to solve the, for the equation of the dependent variable, which is here, this is y. So our solution, I'll just give it to you here um, for, so you can see it, I'll just tell you what the solution is. It is 3x plus x squared, okay? So later on, when you're a little more comfortable with differential equations, you'll be able to go in and find out what the equation or the solution is, but I'm just telling you what the solution is. Um, now also notice that uh, that was the dependent variable, obviously where x, or sometimes we would write it as t is another common independent variable. Um, but you basically just want to solve, if you see the prime here, you want to solve for whatever that equation would be. So we have y prime, we want to solve for y. <clears throat> now I'm going to show you why this is the solution actually. Uh, and then that'll pretty much wrap up this video and then we can move on to classification and uh, get into a little bit different problems with differential equations. But first of all, if we have y, we want to substitute it back. Um, actually, first of all, I want to substitute this in because this this y will mean that like this equation is actually valid. So if we substitute in y is equal to x, 3x plus x squared, the solution will, or this equation will work. So in order to do that, we need to substitute in something for y prime as well, but we can easily find that by differentiating y. So y prime is equal to 3 plus 2x. Okay, so we just want to substitute that into y prime. Um, and now we can just write out this equation. So we have x times y prime, which is 3 plus 2x, minus y, which is 3x plus x squared. Okay. Uh, this is equal to x squared. Um, all right, so we're going to distribute this out. We have 3x plus 2x squared minus 3x minus x squared is equal to x squared. All right, we can uh, simplify this a little. We have 3x minus 3x, get rid of that. We have 2x minus x, or 2x squared minus x squared. So we can get rid of that 2 and get rid of this guy. And that leaves us with x squared is equal to x squared. Hey, look at that. So by substituting in this specific solution here, um, 3x, y is equal to 3x plus x squared, um, also with its given derivative, so we could substitute in the derivative, we, uh, we found out that, yeah, this, uh, this solution actually makes this statement or this equation valid. So anyways, that's just an example just to show you some of the, you know, how a differential equation works. Obviously, I didn't get into a lot of the details, but uh, join me in the next video, and we'll talk about the different classifications for differential equations, and then we'll get right into using all sorts of methods and uh, solving all sorts of differential equations. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video.